What's up guys, welcome back to yet another video. My name is Asad and if this is your first time on my channel, this is a channel all about cinematography, photography, tech reviews and stuff of that nature. I really appreciate the feedback that you guys gave me on my last video around masking transitions in Premiere Pro. In today's video, we're gonna learn how to use the cinematic masking technique where an object is gonna cover the whole screen and then another scene is gonna be revealed underneath that using the masking transition. So without further ado, let's jump into Premiere and let's start creating this transition. And before we do that, don't forget to subscribe if this is your first time here, because we come up with weekly videos around different topics and editing tutorials. So let's jump into Premiere and let's start creating this transition. So guys, we're gonna start by putting the two clips that we are interested in doing this effect on, on the timeline. The top clip is the one that we're gonna be putting the mask on and underneath clip is the one that is gonna reveal the scene that so what we're trying to do is over here is uh we have this you know uh bus that is uh, or like the train that is you know passing through the screen as i said covering the whole screen and we want the effect to start where basically this ends so i've already put a map here if i turn it off it'll it'll look like this and we want this effect to start where you see that you know background start coming up so we don't want that so we want to have our other clip somewhere around here so that we can have the underneath clip showing up so let me put this underneath clip here and i'll show you how we map this okay so we are gonna go here in the effects control panel we're gonna hit this mask icon here and with this being selected, we're gonna select this mask path, mask feather, mask capacity, and mask expansion. Now, with that, now we're gonna go on this clip and you know create points on these masks, and then we're gonna select this option, track selected mask forward. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna apply this mask, as you can see, on every frame, it's applying the mask where we put this. You know mask on and now if i turn this on you can see that it starts revealing the bottom clip so i'll keep on you know selecting and adjusting the mask until i get to the end of this clip and i'm i'm happy with uh you know it's you know showing all the things underneath the bottom clip showing completely and there you have it. You gotta do it frame by frame so that you can basically achieve this look. And you can always adjust this frame. Don't worry about the shape as long as you cover the whole you know scene and make it seamless. So okay, let's let's play it back. Let me go back to the start of this clip and play it for you. So as you can see, the bus is covering the whole screen and then our next clip is revealed underneath. So if you've learned anything of value from this video, please don't forget to subscribe, like, share, and things of that nature. I'll see you guys next week with another video. Until then, goodbye and stay safe.